Hello and welcome to the YouTube channel eDrive. As you probably already know, I'm Alex. In this video I like to tell you the difference about charging with a cold battery pack and with a warm battery pack. Because this morning I started charging with a cold battery pack, that means on my CAN ZE app it shows 2 degrees positive Celsius battery mean temperature. So that's very cold, 2 degrees positive. Even the outside temperature was negative 4 degrees Celsius. But the mean battery temperature was still 2 degrees positive. And uh, when I started charging, the state of charge shown on my display inside the car was 43% state of charge. Then I started charging and I charged for 42 minutes and when I finished charge, uh, when I stopped charging the state of charge was 64%. So from 43% to 64% state of charge it took me 42 minutes charging time. Now after we drove around about yeah, let's say 150 kilometers and I drive I drove sometimes really quick, I make full power that the battery gets really warm and then when I started charging again my state of charge was only 5% so very low, I was already scared, can we still reach the charging station but everything was fine so 5% state of charge and the battery mean temperature on my CAN ZE app was 22 degrees positive 22 degrees positive and then I started charging again on the 43 kilowatt AC charging station and then within the same time 42 minutes I charged from 5% state of charge up to 68% state of charge in the same time 42 minutes so you see with the cold battery from 43 to 64% it took me 42 minutes and now with the warm battery pack from 5% to 68% state of charge it took me also 42 minutes. So the mean battery temperature is a very very big factor of the charging speed. If the battery is cold it took ages and if the battery is warm it's powering in really very very quick. You can do quick charging with a warm battery pack but with a cold battery pack <laughs> forget about quick charging it's very very slow charging. And the problem with the Renault Zoe is it does not have an active battery heating. Only battery cooling but not heating. And uh, what I read already yes the Renault Zoe have a battery heating but it only heats the battery when it's connected to a power supply that means if I'm already at the charging station then it starts charging to heat up the battery but the heating is not that very strong it's only slightly heating that why, that's why forget about it that's why I always try to heat up the battery before while driving I always drive full power so I can see on my display in the car it's consuming 74, 75 kilowatts and then the battery gets warm and if it's warm it's really quick charging. Yeah, so that's it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments please like always put it below in the video in the comment section. I appreciate it always if there's some comment and people talk to me. <laughs> I will try to answer it as best as I can, as best as I possible. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, like always, give me a thumbs down. That's your opinion. That's how you should do it. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe and bye bye. See you next time.